Spider, the video game is a 2.5D platforming video game developed by Boss Game Studios and released on the PlayStation platform in 1997. The game was published by BMG Interactive. The player takes the role of a cybernetic spider, within which the mind of its creator has been implanted. Story Gameplay The player must navigate 3D drawn environments in a strictly 2D manner, traveling to the end of each level using typical platforming game mechanics. The player can use the spider's natural abilities, such as climbing walls and ceilings and using to silk to lower itself, in order to overcome certain obstacles. He can also equip up to four of the ten different cybernetic leg attachments found throughout the game, which are used as weapons. When the player loses a life, all the acquired cybernetic attachments are lost except for the default slasher attachment. The obstacles include lab sinks, acid, test tubes and primarily other cybernetic creatures as enemies. After escaping the laboratory, the player goes to a factory, a museum, and various other locales, each infested with strange and malevolent creatures. Topic. development. According to Boss Game Studios creative director Seth Mendelssohn, they used 2D gameplay for Spider because we wanted to do a game that plays more like the traditional platform game, because they're fun to play. In full form 3D, you can't make a game that plays like a traditional platform game. There are issues about jumping and judging distance. The team opted to make just three bosses for the game so they could give each one more focus, creating more animations and different behaviors for each one. Topic. Reception Spider, the video game received mixed to positive reviews. The most common subject of praise was the use of real spider abilities to crawl on any surface and lower oneself on a thread. Whether or not a critic recommended the game largely hinged on their opinion of the format of 2D gameplay in a 3D environment. As with Pandemonium, which shares this format, Dan Shu of Electronic Gaming Monthly dismissed Spider as a game with good graphics but mediocre gameplay, while his three co-reviewers praised it for its good control and sprawling, non-linear levels, though they complained that the camera occasionally causes problems. A next-generation critic, while noting that the graphics are good and the gameplay has some unique elements, maintained that the 2D nature of the gameplay makes it overly familiar. Ryan McDonald of GameSpot judged it to be a highly enjoyable platformer, and particularly commended how well the spider perspective is handled. GamePro's Scary Larry praised the impressive cinematics, unobtrusive music, and long, non-linear levels, and concluded, you'll need all your spider powers for this game, which can be frustrating, especially when precise leaping is required, but in the end you'll find it's worth it. <laughs>